Number one, Duke hosting Clemson, a team who has not won in Durham since 1995. Now, there was a slow start for both teams in the first half. Mason Plumley, though, trying to spark a little something with this steal. Yeah, he gets it up eventually to a guy who heats up when it matters. There he is, Ryan Kelly, buries the three. Blue Devils ahead by four. Now, later on, more struggles for Clemson. Demarcus Harrison, there he is driving in the lane with a miss. Now, Jordan Roper, though, he got a shot out of two. Also a miss. Tigers made just three of 25 from the field in the first half. Now, Kelly, who carries this Duke offense, 12 points in the first half for him. He made more points than Clemson in the first half as we break Duke up 25 to 10. Now, Kelly does not return in the second half with an apparent foot injury, but there's Seth Curry for three to become Mr. 1000. He joins the 1000 Career Points Club with that bucket to put the Blue Devils up 32-14. Who else to step up for Kelly, though, than Quinn Cook showing out on the boards, cleaning things up. Blue Devils ahead by 20 now. Watch this guy. When he's cooking, you better be careful, sinks a beautiful three. Guy's a gamer, so impressive tonight. Again, Cook carrying the Blue Devils. His third three of the game gets it done for Duke tonight. Made 12 of 16 from the field for a career high 27 points. Duke cruises 68 to 40, and they are 15 and 0 as they head to NC State on Saturday. If you call yourself a basketball fan, you've got to watch our brand new show. It's called ACC Live. And guess what? Tomorrow it features a one-on-one -on -one interview with Coach K. So tune in on the ACC Digital Network at noon.